Students at one school in the Rochester City School District took to the streets this morning to call for peace as gun violence and other crime continues to rise in the city. They hope their chance for change will be heard so they can grow up in safer neighborhoods. Alex Love is live at school number 54 with highlights of the school-wide event. Alex. This event was very important to people who live in these neighborhoods, Teresa. So far this year, the School 54 community has seen four homicides in their area. Now students are saying enough is enough and want to take their streets back by holding a peace march. Every single one of you deserves to go to school in a safe neighborhood. By partnering with the nonprofit Save Rochester, School 54 gave students the opportunity to march down Otis and then Lyle Avenue so they could spread their own messages about keeping the peace. It's so important to be out here because, like, we got to show justice for people that die. You, you, you just can't, like, you just don't care about people because you never know if it's going to happen to your family member or you. I don't want to come outside and hear shootings and stuff on, and on TV because you don't know if you go outside you just like like people might like kidnap you or stuff and I don't want that to happen. Seeing their kids get this much involved to unite the community oh, and parents and teachers proud and confident they can make this And it shows that it means a lot to them for the virus to stop. Like some, some like sometimes our kids can't even come outside because of the violence that's out, and you know we got to make safe, safe for them to you know be able to come out and play and not be scared. The uh, the last act of violence happened. We had pre-K on the playground when the shots went off, and if that doesn't get people to stand up and do something, I don't know what's going to. During the march, local activists spoke with the students to explain their own experiences of losing children and family of their own to gun violence in the hope it teaches them to think about what matters the most before getting caught up into trouble. If you go to somebody's house and they have a gun, tell them you want to go home. We got to put the guns down. The guns are not the answers. We got to stop shooting up houses. We got to stop shooting up cars. We love you. This march went on without any incidents thanks to Rochester Police and the Lord's Motorcycle Club escorting students through traffic. Live in Rochester, Alex Love, News 8.